Well, first of all, uh, obviously a uh, disappointing uh, uh, night for us. Uh, not uh, not the way we envisioned it going. But uh, let me just first say I'm, I'm incredibly thankful uh, for our team. I'm thankful for our team. I'm thankful for God's grace for allowing me to be a part of uh, such a special group of people, coaches, staff, and players. And uh, just just an unreal year. I mean, incredible. It just incredible year. It, two years. Uh, we've won 29 games in a row. It's been a long time since I've stood in front of a team uh, with a loss. And um, But this team in particular, uh, just really special. Uh, coming into this year, you know, 80 freshmen and sophomores out of 120. Um, to get back to this point, I'm just super proud of them. It's incredibly difficult to even get here and super hard to win it, that's for sure. Um, but I'm proud of our guys. Incredible leadership and focus all year long. And, uh, you know, a lot of history made by this group. And uh, forever grateful uh, for these seniors. These seniors... What an amazing group of young people, just just dynamic young people that are unbelievably committed. And, um, uh, you know, just Tanner Muse and Pollard and Servinka and Ankrum, um, you know, just Denzel and Kayvon, I mean, Fibs, I mean, so many guys, just tremendous, tremendous uh, leadership. And so I'm, I'm thankful and uh, just blessed to have been a part of it with these guys and uh, but tonight was was all about LSU. Uh, what an unbelievable game! Um, you know, we we had an opportunity there in the third quarter. I, I loved how we responded and, and uh, got the ball back with a three point lead, and and uh, we just couldn't quite put enough plays together. Uh, you know, it's probably the worst we've been on third down in a long time. We had opportunities on third down, but we just didn't just didn't convert um, and uh, give them credit. But uh, I thought LSU played a beautiful game. Um, I thought their quarterback was tremendous. Those receivers, they made some incredible plays that were uh, really well covered, uh, several of them. And, um, you know, but, but they just made the play. And that's what you got to do to win these type of games. So you give them credit. I thought they played a heck of a game and deserved to win the game. Uh, they were, they were uh, definitely the better team tonight for sure. So uh, I'm really happy for Coach O. Uh, I think he's a, uh, one of the good guys in the business, and, and you know I'm, I'm happy for him. Um, I know what it's like to, to be in that situation, and you, you pour a lot into it, and, and um, um, you know certainly uh, no fun to be in this seat. But um, but I do um, uh, you know just say congratulations to them and uh, a beautiful football team that earned it, and uh, we were the first 15 and 0 team last year, and. And to see them uh, do it, and uh, you know they earned it. Simple as that. Uh, so hats off to them. And and I thought they played with tremendous uh, 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 character and class, and just will to win. And uh, that's what championship games are all about. And and uh, just too many big plays, and not just not quite enough from us uh, when we had some opportunities to to give ourselves a chance there in the fourth quarter. Um, but again, just proud of our seniors. Uh, these guys are leaving here with 55 wins. And, um, you know, this hurts right now. Uh, a lot of pain. I'm, I'm, I'm disappointed. I hurt for all of our fans. Uh, but what an incredible run. And, um, you know, we'll get back to work. We start spring ball six weeks from Wednesday. And uh, excited about next year's team. And, uh, you know, the challenge of uh, uh, going back to work and putting another team together. Uh, so uh, we'll celebrate this group. We're going to have our banquet next weekend. We'll celebrate this wonderful group of seniors uh, the right way. And then we'll, uh, we'll get back to work and uh, see if we can get back here.